Hello, what's up everybody? It's Hightower and Axial Matt here. Hey, guys! And for this week's Indie Night, we're looking at Johnny Carnage. Johnny Carnage, you say? Is, is he, like, related to Johnny Bravo? Uh, I, I hope so. Uh, they don't have the similar hairstyle, but they, they seem to have similar motives in the form of chasing women. Yeah, they, they, I, I did play this one. I remember. Th this was a lot of fun, actually. Yeah. So, like, basically... How much was it? It was a dollar, right? It's, I think it's 80 points. I, I mostly yeah. cover 80-point games, because it's like, you get really cheap games that are really awesome. Like Cassie's animal sounds. Yeah, Th this one was really awesome. Th he like chases women the whole game. Pretty much. The point is that some sort of alien skeleton things, I don't know, what I can't remember what they're called, uh, kidnapping <laughs> women and freezing them in blocks of ice and you have to go around these side-scrolling maps and free them. <laughs> that's what that's what alien skeleton things do all yeah. the time, right? Like, I know, I don't know. We see your women, we will put them in blocks of ice. Hurrah. <laughs> but their mission thing. So, yeah, basically... Um, it's what the interesting thing is that like, it doesn't have a health system. In fact, like when you free the women, you it gives you extra time, and when you take damage, you lose time. So that's it. that's weird. Whenever I'm with women, I lose time. Right? I usually lose my money. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. like I haven't I haven't been with a woman yet. I don't I don't <laughs> go out and do social things. I sit around playing indie games all the time. <laughs> well, see, that's you get the woman in the indie game, right? There you go. Damn straight. Yeah, Dude, sure. Cassie's animal sounds is where most of my nights go. <laughs> I cannot blame you, that game's hilarious. Okay. That was like the best indie game ever. Okay, uh, completely off topic, but I definitely bought that because you showed it to me. <laughs> it's <laughs> such a good game. That, that, uh, that's where all my lonely nights go. Yeah, listen to but, some woman act like a dragon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some people so, pay top dollar for that, high <laughs> Dude, I paid 80 points for it. Well, you only paid one dollar, alright, you're good. I'm good, but <laughs> we get back to Johnny Carnage. So yeah, it's a it's a side-scrolling shooter, and um, there's a variety of weapons. Like you get money, and you have to buy weapons from vending machines and stuff. Kind yeah. of like it kind of reminds me of Black Ops Zombies mode. Yeah, well, because you know all vending machines have guns in, in the Alien and Festive Future. Yeah, I mean that's how it works. I, those big fuckers? I remember that. Those things were annoying. The big ones? Yeah. yeah that I, everything's I, annoying. I had a weird moment where I was running on a, above, on a platform just above another ground. There was a load of little guys just jumping up and down. And it was just, I just stood there for about five minutes watching it because I thought it was the cutest thing ever. <laughs> oh, man. That seems awesome. But, yeah. That was Johnny... That's Johnny Carnage. 80 what? points on the Xbox Indie Marketplace. No. And head to AchievementHunter.com for more videos. Later, guys.